on my interview, I just fell in love with this place. I just felt like I really connected with the professors that I was interviewing with. And when I went home and I was getting snowed on while walking to work, <laughs> I just knew I wanted to go back to UCLA. What sets UCLA apart as a place to be a biosciences graduate student is its really youthful, pioneering spirit and a genuine culture of collaboration. UCLA is not even 100 years old, and yet we receive over a billion dollars a year in competitive research awards. Those are remarkable accomplishments for such a young university and really testaments to the innovative scholarship of our faculty and our trainees. Everything is about student initiative. And since we have such a strong, vibrant graduate community, a lot of really cool things get done because people have great ideas and are able to implement them because UCLA is just built for people with good ideas to figure something out and run with it. I love the people and the environment here. Collaborations are happening on every corner of the campus. I feel like I have a family here. You can always find a expert in the field here, uh, and they're always very willing to, to, to work with you. I got to collaborate with a lot of people, and if I came up with an experiment and it was in a totally different field, and it involved a physicist and a microscopist and whoever else, I would just go find those people and I would talk to them and we would do the experiment, and it was really, really fun to do that. There's a lot of great graduate networking at UCLA. There's events all the time. We have Bruin Talks, which brings students from all over biosciences together. So it's really nice and it's a low pressure environment for us to just practice our talk, hang out. It's a really great time for all of us. My PI is such an awesome mentor. I have freedom to explore ideas that I think are interesting, while at the same time having the high standard of quality that my PI uh, expects of his students. Now that I get the opportunity to teach and help other people become scientists too, I see it from another perspective. It's almost more rewarding to see them discover something and get that feeling of joy than it is for me. Graduates of our bioscience PhD program have gone on to do remarkable things. We have former graduate students who are now faculty at institutions across the country, from Harvard to NYU, UCSF, UT Southwestern, NIH, and many others. And so each of them in their own way is now leading groups of individuals who are making very high impact discoveries. I could see myself being a professor at a medical school. I could also see myself being a genetic counselor. And I could see myself doing statistical analysis in biotech. So big picture, career-wise, it still seems like a lot of doors are open. Now more than ever, we need brilliant, passionate, motivated, creative young scientists who are going to dedicate their careers to investigating the natural world, to understanding biology, to finding cures for disease. Let's beat Zika virus by understanding the virus and, and creating cures. Let's conquer cancer by understanding the immune system and using it to combat cancer. Let's understand the brain so that we can live in a world that doesn't suffer from psychiatric illness. Let's be able to develop cures for each and every individual and let's dedicate the very best part of ourselves, our ability to think deeply and really transform the world to make it into the place that we can dream it could be.